What up, Internet? This is Cruz of Filmcats. We're taking a look at Boss Battles HD by Backflip Studios. Okay, uh, here's a whole bunch of screenshots. Looks pretty cool. And it's called Boss Battles, so you're normally fighting bosses. I thought there weren't even going to be any, like, peon or small dudes that you could pee on, but it starts out... Uh, well, my video starts out with the boss, because that's how I thought the game was going to start out. But each level opens with you fighting these little super easy dudes. Um, they start out super easy, and then each level, and there's a lot of levels, uh, throw something new at you. When you get to the level that has supply depots, you're going to geek out, because they fly at crazy angles. And I would try to tell you what my strategy is, but I couldn't explain it with just words, and I'm not even showing you that one. I'm going to show you the one that I'm stuck on right now. And the reason I'm stuck at it is because I've only upgraded my weapon once, and I splurged all my money on lives. I don't know if that was the right thing to do. But I die a lot, so I was trying to get nine lives. Uh, okay, so it starts out with these little amoeba dudes, and it kind of sucks because they're pseudo-transparent at the bottom of the screen. Like, they blend in because they're all, like, photosynthetic and shit. Um, they are these, like, multi-tailed uh, little spermsters, and my weapon kills them pretty fast, but... I wish I had an upgraded weapon so bad! In some of the iTunes preview screens, one of them flares out and fires like three missiles at once. Uh, one fires directly, like, in a T pattern, like, outside of you. So one directly in front of you and then 90 degree angles out to the side. And that would be baller for this boss that I'm about to fight because I can't get anywhere. Um, there are these, like, jewels and coins that flow down and your, your little spaceship, like, naturally attracts them. And, yeah, I'm still kind of warming up on this game, despite the fact that I've already, like, beat two pages of levels. I'm super hot at games! Okay, this boss is ridiculous. Um, he fires a lot, and you need to be popping all these bubbles. But some of the bubbles are not exposed all the time, so he does this flare-out thing. It sucks. I hate it. So he does this flare-out thing, where, like, they all expand from the radius in, like, a clockwise fashion, or counterclockwise fashion, or whatever. And then you need to get on the inside and then start lighting them up from there. And then they start... Uh, then they start firing. Hmm. Then they start firing on the inside. And then it's like, oh, then they're going to come back inside while they're firing. And there's these little pink flies everywhere. I'm trying to hear that. I need a better weapon. I need a better weapon. It's way too hard. I've played this a lot and I still can't get past it. So I'm kind of mad. Um, when you do beat a level, you get a bounty, and that's how you earn money. So I don't know, am I supposed to be playing the old levels over and over and then just grinding for money? Or should I just be a baller and spend like $3 and then show up with like this BFG gun that you just tap once and it like kills everything on the screen? Anybody remember that BFG gun? It was short for Big Effing Gun. And I think it might have been from... From Doom? But you can call me out and tell me how much of a fake nerd I am if I'm wrong. Uh, that's it for this episode of Phone Cats. This was Boss Battles. This is free, so if you got an iOS device, uh, scoop it up and then probably end up spending money. Because that's how they get you. Phone Cats.